What's up guys, my name is Delio, and today we are going to be talking about Outbreak. So I've been playing it over the past couple days, and let me just say this, wow. I really like this mode. Of course it's not perfect, but there's a lot of good aspects to it, so let's jump into the good aspects. I really like the gameplay, it's really fun. Being able to have a open world style zombies mode is really transformative to the gameplay. In fact, it's completely revolutionary. I really wasn't expecting this to be as fun as it is, but being able to drive cars and run over zombies and do all these challenges and stuff like that, I really like that. And let's talk about the objectives in this mode because I really like this. And the main thing I really like about them is the fact that you're not obligated to start them. You could literally run around for like hours, you know, just not doing anything, just killing zombies and looking for side quests. You could do that if you want to. Of course, if you want to advance in the mode, you actually have to do the objectives, but having the freedom to choose when you want to do them is really great. And I think if they add more objectives to the mode at some point, add more areas, it'd be great. Let's also talk about some of the side objectives that you're actually given as well. So you're able to go around the map looking for loot crates. They can either be the really small ones, the medium ones, or the large ones. You can also find some gold ones around the map that are locked so you have to you know prove that you're worthy or whatever kill some bosses and then you can finally get that those have the loot that you can get from like the common dance easter egg and stuff like that which is pretty awesome you can also find a little sort of gersh looking orb it's like a tiny anomaly if you shoot it a bunch of times it drops a bunch of points and it goes around the map two or three times once it gets to its last spot and you shoot it it disappears and it drops you more essence and just, you know, weapons or something, or even a score streak. That's a pretty cool side objective. And you also have the dragon relics where you can essentially do the Dorizendrock dragon step by just filling it up. And you can also get another gold loot crate from that, depending on how many zombies you actually fill. Because if you don't fill the whole entire meter, it can actually give you a small, medium, or large one without actually giving you the gold one, so it's not 100% guaranteed. So you gotta make sure you're filling up the max amount of zombies kills. So the side objectives are really cool in this mode, and in season three, there's gonna be a lot more stuff added. There's gonna be a whole main quest in this mode, and I imagine there's also gonna be some more maps other than what we got at the current moment so yeah those are my positives on the mode and let's jump into the negatives so the main negatives that i have about this mode is the fact that there's only a limited number of vehicles on the map and if they explode or whatever and take damage you can't repair them so i hope down the line they either have the vehicles respawn at some point or just add more vehicles throughout the map because just having four maybe five vehicles on the map really isn't enough and a repair system would be pretty cool as well. Another thing that's kind of annoying, but I wouldn't say is necessarily a horrible thing is the Tempest. That thing is so freaking annoying to deal with because it's constantly teleporting all over the place. It's pretty much just an Avogadro, which as you know, that thing was really annoying in transit. So it's no different here in Outbreak. And honestly, I can't really think of that many cons or just negatives about this mode. Like in my personal opinion, I just don't see it. I, I have fun with the mode and of course, you know, maybe add some more zombies, maybe add some more maps, more objectives, you know, that's just all, you know, the basic stuff. All in all, I'm really enjoying this mode, and I'd even say that I'm enjoying it more than your traditional zombies mode that's actually in the game, which is kind of surprising. I was not expecting to say that, but that's just how I feel at this current moment. So yeah, that was my take on Outbreak. How do you guys feel about Outbreak? I feel pretty positive right now, and if I truly didn't like it, and I had a bunch of issues with it, I'd make a video ranting about it. You know, I like to be honest about my thoughts on, you know, Call of Duty and just these modes in general. I genuinely enjoy this mode, so I don't I don't have too many, you know, problems with it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did and you want to see some more videos on the channel, make sure to drop a like. I'm currently on the road to a thousand subscribers. We're getting closer and closer day by day. We're like 160 away at this point. So if you guys want to help out, hit the subscribe button, turn on notifications and never miss a video when I upload it. You're not obligated to do so, but it'd be nice if you could. And yeah, thanks so much for watching. And I hope you all have a wonderful day.